It has been almost impossible to avoid seeing something about the election over the last few months. If you have been able to do that, please reach out to me. I want to know your story. Most of us will have our eyes glued to the TV as votes come in tomorrow. Gilat Malamud spoke to some people who just want it to all be over. What will you be doing when election results start to roll in? Turning off the news and maybe watching a movie or something and waking up Wednesday and seeing what happened and avoiding all the Tuesday night drama. But for political junkies like Chris Jones. You know, I'll be all into it. I mean, it's it's more exciting than any sporting event by a long shot. According to Nielsen, 71 million Americans tuned into primetime election coverage in 2016. About 30 million shy of this year's Super Bowl. Most people plan to watch on the television probably just a little while and then most most of it will probably follow the social media later on. Some are even throwing dinner parties. A lot of us are house divided, so we thought all the girls would go down to um, Ellicottville and either celebrate or not and leave the guys home. How long do people plan to keep watching when there could be no apparent winner on election night? Same bedtime. Yes, absolutely. If there are any significant results, I'm going to ask my roommates to wake me up in case there's celebration or something. Many say it's not about celebrating who wins, but celebrating no more coverage. And I just want to get it over with at this point. I will be excited when it's all over, for sure. That's one thing I can't wait for tomorrow, for it to all be over. According to the American Psychological Association, 68% of adults say this presidential election is a significant source of stress in their life. It would be a big stress reliever once it's over. Like I think a lot of people was kind of like on edge and stressed out. While Political diehards will start the countdown to 2024. It's like the day after the election is like the day after after Christmas. But no matter how you feel about it, that day after will come. You know, the reality is either way, November 4th is going to come. So now we want to know how you'll be spending election night. Take our Twitter poll or join in on the conversation on our Facebook page. In Buffalo, Gilat Malamud, 7 Eyewitness News.